How are you? Are you all right? Praise the Lord. Can my wife come? Can you give my wife a hand? It's lovely to be here. Uh, the first time preach on your pulpit, your new pulpit. So uh, thank you very much. Say hello. Oh, okay. <laughs> hello. Yeah. You can be seated. <laughs> okay. Um, it is a great honor to be here. Isn't God good? Isn't he wonderful? Isn't he so amazing that he has given us this span of time that we can spend together worshiping him um, together? I mean, I love this kind of place and this kind of time because he has appointed us in our own places of work and ministry and where you minister but when he opens time and places like this it's so overwhelming isn't it and only God can make those times and he directed our paths and navigate and um, causes all elements in this universe so we can be together we just want to thank and honor your senior pastors and princess and queen Annie and all of you this morning you know you are very most important person before God because why because he purchased you with his blood and uh, we can stand righteous before him and worship him and adore him because he has covered and watched us, bought us with his own life. You know, this morning as um, Timo was opening, he said, you know, there's a lot of funerals, a lot of um, uh, weddings and things like that. Even just recently, last week, that we farewell our beloved father, Motu. So those things, it, we, it kind of, you know, it kind of tilled our our walk and even our own soul. But the Bible says, even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I fear no evil. And amazing that David said, because in the midst of my enemies, in the midst of that valley, Jesus, God has laid a table for us. See, sometimes we are so focused on the father of love, the funerals, and you know, um, it's amazing how I thought, God, when is this going to stop? We've been having funerals since, since April week after week after week but you know sometimes we're so overwhelmed with these things we forget to look there is a table that God has laid for us in the midst of this valley that we're going through and it is up to you to look for that that table where he will come and say sit down I know you're going through some hard times. I know your soul is pain, so grieving for the loved ones. But sit down. Let me pour an oil upon your head. Just to let you know, I'm right here with you. I am walking with you through this valley. And dear, this is not your destination. It's just a walking through. This is just a, a journey. This is a pathway. And this is not for you. But I just want to let you know that I'm here. And uh, why don't we do a, um, what do you call, transaction. Give me your yoke. I'll give you my yoke. Give me your burden. I'll give you your bur my burden. Because my yoke is easy. And my burden is light. And sometimes we take up unnecessary yoke, unnecessary burden that Jesus has never, ever intended for us to carry or intended for us to yoke to. But Jesus said, take my yoke. My yoke is easy and my burden is light. Amen. 
So I just want to encourage you because I know you went through a lot. And we do too. It's just a season, by the way. But let's walk through this valley. It is a journey. May God bless you. And uh, thank you for having us. We're grateful to God for the opportunity to be together and thank you for giving us uh, this time to share with you and uh, to uh, um, preach from your pulpit. First time. It's good. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hey, uh, Salam oyonus full moleiva, Psalm 69. Uh, you normally have two services, you have one this morning, so I'm going to preach for two services, okay? <laughs> Excuse me. And verse 1, <clears throat> I'll read uh, the English Bible. Save me, O God, for the waters have come up to my soul, to my neck. I sink in the deep mire where there is no standing. I have come into deep waters where the floods overflow me. Matala to Spaya led to a foul of my yatau a wa oa oa. Oh, nay, I'm a lemo laba will bite. But I have no toilet palapala loto, ele o yaise me to wai. Wa ola baawi meloloto ole bai wolofia uile bai tafe David is a man after God's own heart <laughs> I'm reading back to myself Ole tangata to tu solo na loto male loto le tua and yet, even though he walked with God through the valley of the shadow of death and fed by God, I'm going to drown. The flood waters have come up to my soul. There are, see, a flood is not necessarily water. And the whole world is drowning in a virus nobody knows where it started from and no one knows the cure for the thing. There is a flood that's coming to the planet. For my little tala tavita, Faola was so lolo, let towel to spare some more of my taffy. We'll just use lolo, thing of here and ah. Elena tell out me for pena, our male sawanga. There's violence coming into the planet. We have more education and more problems. Tingale matautia ole hawa uino tangata. 
and the more education has not diminished the need e ma wolu lunga fale ai ma wolu lalo manatu we have wider motorways and narrower viewpoints but may not have it foul out hallelujah and my wife shared we've had funerals after funerals after funerals and we have weddings and then we have funerals i tell my staff at home you do the funerals i do the weddings the weddings are better than the funerals <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. Well, how, how do you survive? How do you survive a flood? And how do you prepare for a flood? If I prefer my sow is a lolo, now let you soon not me some more. Sika mai ba enga o Samoa no la bea ai na ma fa tia o mo le a tunu e le nga to 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 nga te no no fo Samoa ka ko just a little flood hallelujah if i prefer la na sao o oil to nga to le tua and how do you relate to a flood are you okay I'm just going slowly on. For my little child to spare, no fire le tua le langi malolo langi le amatanga. Darkness was on the face of the flood. For my no fitia le lolo le pauliuli le tau fonga tau le fonga tau. That's a flood. So right at the beginning. We started with a flood. Na matale langi malelo langi lelolo. Fai maile chala chuspaya e fa vaile tua me uma lelolo. He established it on the floods. Fai maila olai e ufitia lelolo le pauliuli. I no fole nganga pa iya ilunga lelolo. So darkness covers the face of the flood, the face of the deep, but the spirit of God was sitting on the face of the waters. And no fall at two way lolo. God is a flood dweller. That's where he dwells. And right from the beginning, the spirit of God Hovered over the flood. Ola la je chilo chilo i meye chupu, e je chilo chilo i lolo ya o mai. Ai ngalo ya o e, e yai le changa chala e no foi dunga le lolo. And if you understand the spirit of God, then you will not be taken by surprise. Because the Spirit of God sits on the flood. In no folly and nanga pa ia ilunga le lolo, but Malatala Timon el Tayao, or Tapua inga fa pentecoso, elefa calices, and I oil and nanga pa ia, and I oil and nanga pa ia, or the teller time and nalo ya tato. I saw the lolo, and I oil and I'm a boy. I lung on the lolo, and it doesn't matter what happens when the spirit moves; he moves on the flood. Yeah, hallelujah, praise God. Yeah, lady. Are you okay? Yeah. Say amen. Amen. Praise God. You can stand if you want to, but I'm going to sit down. Hallelujah. If you ever look at uh, Isaiah 59, Isaiah Limas Ful Maliva.
Hallelujah. Verse 19. So shall they fear the name of the Lord from the west and his glory from the rising of the sun. When the enemy comes in like a flood, the Spirit of God will lift up the standard against him. But my Hallelujah. Read the Psalm on Bible, okay? For my Asaule Fili Peyole by Tafe, Asaule Fili Peyole Lolo, on a Saula Lerang of Payale, no foiluma Lolo, on a sea Tiale Lerang of Payale Tangavai. I told it and I buy lung on the lolo. When the enemy comes in like a flood, the spirit that sits on the flood, so the enemy comes like a flood, the Holy Spirit who dwells on the flood will take the standard and put the standard on the flood. On a saula le ngang pa ia, on a si tia le le ngang pa ia le le tanga vai, ai tu le tanga vai lungo le lolo. O la tanga vai Samoa, fa vai le tua Samoa. That's a tanga vai. But my lord tell us pa ia, e saula ngang pa ia, on a abel le tanga vai le tua. A fatula or tanga vaile tua, ilumole, ole lolole, saumarki apolo. So the enemy can come like a flood, but the Spirit of God will take the tanga vai, will take the standard and put the standard on the flood. So the question is this what is the standard of God? What is the measuring rod of God? I am so long on a paya, a so long on a paya city out. A so long a lolo, a so let the Apollo pace a lolo. On a so long on a paya, see the tongue of Bayale tua, a see a sukariso, a fatty a tear a sukariso on a lolo. Are you okay? So the Spirit of God sits on the flood. And the Son of God sits on the flood. Uh, are you all right? And no folly and a paia lungo le lolo. And no for foil a tuole alo lungo le lolo. Why? Because God dwells on the flood. God is a flood dweller. Are you all right? Say Amen. Salamu e luos from Riva. Or is it Psalm 19? Let's have a look. Salamu e luos from Riva. Pope is full. The Lord sat enthroned at the flood. And sometimes we are just overwhelmed by the floods when they come that we forget 
to look above the flood. We just look at the flood. And you're looking at the flood, overwhelming everything, forgetting that look at the top of the flood because the Father sits there, the Son sits there, and the Holy Ghost sits there. <laughs> Are you all right? Aren't you glad you came to church this morning? How do you, as a son and a daughter of God, sit on a flood? In a yawane lo fia oe, I find Maritala Yesu, Tato teno nofo fa tasi, Makeriso i mea oile, Langi far above all principalities and powers. Ole manao la ole tua, enofo tupu oe, not, not just after every, ema faina nofo fa tasi oe Makeriso right now. Say amen. You may not have a, don't know when we'll come back here and preach again, but uh, I want to leave something behind. We want to leave something with you. Maltalale <coughs> Tua. The Kamaloa Engoya Noa, my Noa Lela Lolo, for my Maltala Yesu, a pay on a po Noa. So we are not living unprepared and unwarned. Jesus said we are living in a very exact time as a man named Noah lived. And Noah lived in a time of a flood. Yeah, that's right. Hallelujah. Amen. Now we're going to preach. The beginning, that was just the introduction to give you an understanding <laughs> of where we are. We haven't started the message yet. That was the introduction. This is for you now. How do you build a Christianity that will survive the flood? On the following level, if I let Tala let to a ya noa, it ain't law and no as a meta was a lolo. Now, Pawal and me and I law and noa, or the teleolea muleanga tanata. But my little Tala let to a, it's gonna, it's gonna flood. I want you to build an ark for you and your family. I may have foul a bar or the atola out. The ark, it's a boat, but it's called the ark. Ole atola aula, e yaito tonu le mamalu ole tua. Ole mena tua i mose, ole ark, le tau le atokome. Au to tonu na yaile mamalu ole tua. Ole atola aula le tua na fea moai le tai me mose, sa yaito tonu le mamalu ole tua. Fai mele tala le tua ya no no, build an ark, e yaito tonu le mamalu ole tua. But you build an ark, because it's going to flood. Three hundred cubits long. That's about the size of four rugby football fields. It's not a small boat. That's right. Yeah. Elima se fulu kupita lona lauteli. Etolu se fulu kupita lona 
etolu on the funga ma, etasi on the fight to toa, kasi malonga fa malama. And that's what God wants us to do. If I use to I na kerisiano, ema fai on a lelo fia ise vaitafe. Are you okay? Yeah. Is this all right? Yeah. So 300 cubits long, 50 wide, 30 up, three floors, three decks, one door, one window. Elephant may tolu shelau merkasi. And if I may lose a lawiva, my tongue shall out. What is that? It's something that is perfect. Ole mea e a totoa. Ole mea e a toa. It's perfect. It's complete. It's matured. Maltala. Altu spaya, e ono sfuruli mata usangao. O e noka, e fa nau lolo na atali. Ma mai lolo tala tu spaya, na amata mai le asole na, na sava vali e noka maletua. E le lope na yei se mea i fōlinga o le tama, na whai loa ai ia e noka, e whaa pea fōlinga o le tua. And Enoch began to walk with God when his son was born 65 years, he was, when he was 65. And Enoch walked with God 300 years. And God took him. Because he had this testimony that he pleased God. Ola ina ia fia fiere tu yawe. Oa te ola ina ia fia fia tanga te. A fia fia tanga te yawe. Oh, that's great. A ola ina ia fia fia le tu yawe. And sometimes a fia fia le tu yawe. E le fia fia tanga ka yawe. Sometimes when you're pleasing God. People are not happy with you. They want to decorate you to what their image is, to make you into their image. God wants to make you into his image. Hallelujah. He walked with God 300 years and God took him. It's a perfect walk. That means you walk with God every day of the year. Hallelujah. But he walked with God 300 years. Perfect. 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 Or kelela o holanga o kaka o e apurpurua. Menai manau mia e saka e saka le holanga o kaka langa. Hallelujah. Au le mea e o matua le mea o atotoa. Fa malitala tu spaya. Mark the perfect man. The end of that man is peace. Hallelujah. Amen. Say amen. 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 Amen.
Ile ya kitiona, kitiona. Chula yalu ile maloshi ngai ke yai. Go in this your strength. On alu lo leo kitiona. E e fa putu le vai na au. On a mau leo e kalesi e tolus fuluafe. Has a big church. Colus fuluafe. 32,000 people in the church. And know what God said? There's too many people in the church for me to be honored. You know how many people left? 22,000. From 32,000 church, now 10,000. There's still too many. Take them down to the river, and I'm going to test them at the river. And my father and I knew, my Malia le by Tafe, or La Tow of Fia Inu or Mile Bai, and my father and I would buy Male Oli Oli by Puno or Falutanga. You can draw water out of the wells of salvation with joy. But while you're doing it, God is testing you. La la fire oy akelelo. La tiro tiro mai le tu. O la mo kwa e ke kan ye te perfetane. O a feta la mai le nga nga le tu. Fa mai no mal kala si lo mo kwa fi o la wo maliu sa mo mai. Se po nga sai mai nga fe au. And while you're enjoying the presence of God, while enjoying the river of the Holy Spirit, while you're enjoying all that, God is testing your heart. You know how many? Three hundred. Out of 32,000, God could do more with 300 matured ones than 32,000 fakau kau. That's very good English, eh? 32,000 fakau kau. And my fire led to one of my men, my manna, it's a not at all. I eat it, I'm being a little, but there were 300. Hallelujah. Hello? You're being tested and you're found to be matured. Elilingi le le fangu wa Maria. E fau wai kiriso. E fa malita la yuta. Ma u maul fangu. Kile kanga kafa penga fa kule me ave ma mau mau. Do le tala a vau. Oi lau chiro ina vau le sabo. O maliu vau sa o masai pipi. Cousin of Anga Auma or Yeremia. Well, I like two fala matine, they waffle a salad long. I have a multala bow, a little bow. Your fala of Altala bow, Manga yellow king. A multala fala. It is a king at Tino Loco, a multala bow, Mau Mau. That's all right. If I'm on air, Fala can watch it. It's true. It's, it's exactly true. So if he watches it, it's true.
Fa mai la tala ayu cha mau mau le fangu la mele fa cha wai tenari fia ko shalau on a avele tanga ta machiva where did where did judas o o you tell on kalare ah la tu sia e e yone a mai tala ayu cha e fa cha le cho shalau where did he get that 300 he knew it's a perfect price why don't we sell the oil for the perfect price of 300 denarii and give it to the poor? Ele fai mai la onga onga fa pe e lo fa you try to not match Steve and I just langa o yela va ya pe kanga la u apostolo tu e la to tu pe Are you all right? But Judas said 300 because he knew it's a perfect price. But mentala le tu the length of the ark is 300. It's a tested price. It's a tested thing. It proves maturity in God. Yes. Praise God. 50 cubits wide. What is 50? 50 is Pentecost. 50 is Jubilee. Lima se fulu o le fa unga wa mata ngo fie malilei. Ina wa fa nau le kalesia na fa nau mai le aso Pentecoso. Na fa nau le kalesia na fa nau Pentecoso. The church was born Pentecost. If it was born Pentecost, it should grow up Pentecost. Ele fa naula le kalesi Pentecoso ai ku bai ose si mea. Ah. Pole alama la le label e tu yai le ngole kalesi na e te lo tu ai. O te manao e te lo na fa naula kalesi fa naula aso Pentecoso na fa nau Pentecoso. Ele tu bua la se Pentecoso o le Pentecoso. Now you can argue that in theology, but you can't argue against the fact that when the church was born, it was actually born Pentecost. No far now, no far now, lo manu, is Samoa. No far now, our Samoa. Kelei kupuai wo konga. I was born a Samoan. I grew up a Samoan. I wasn't born Samoa and grow up a Tongan. If the church is born Pentecost, it can't go up anything else but Pentecost. Hallelujah. full. Faunga wa to torna lei. Jubilee, restoration. God restoring the gifts, the power. Back into the church. I'll tell a lot of Pentecostal by coming a Napawal make a Pentecostal Paki Paki. Papawama? And we call it Pentecost. We might as well go to a fine Nasiba Wai Paki Paki. But we need to allow the Spirit of God to move in a Pentecostal church to divide the word correctly and the Spirit of God moving. Like he move on the face of the waters. Are you all right? Hallelujah. It told us full of people on the Maulunga. I'm now at a at your Stoulanga. It ain't my fine. I was Stoulanga. I told us full of those. Na fau ta vita tolus furta usanga na ko vana ya Joseph al tolus furta usanga and you become a priest at 30 years old it's a potential that is it's got stuff waiting for it it's a potential power a potential wisdom a potential anointing the difficulty we find many times is it just remains a potential but never grows beyond that 
e ke kilo kilo ra ka ka fa ko wo i ma ka ukia le me wo tu e le tu a i o ti a lo tu ma we le fa nga nga me ma le tu it it just remains a potential and nothing ever happens why don't we do what samuel did samuel we na fa samuel me fa sai fa sai le ka le sia fa the mental to spoil a sana a sana na os na fa in kaula se no to lus furu a sa samuel like ki ya fa ma yel e fota e va bai or me ngai fa e os ka a sa samuel fa ka ka ila ki ki ya fa ka ka in fa kaula a tiro tiro mo ile tuo me that's fantastic and sometimes when you're walking with god there are certain things that you can do because you have the courage from God to do it. And that young boy's potential was recognized when he was a boy. And my little child just for you, he led pa usa na upul pal pala. I fa tonu ele tu. Are you alright? Yeah. Gonna hurry now. It all one of nga ba It's a pena O le tsanga tsa ola la It all one of nga ba O le nganga O le lotso Maletino Le tsela o tsanga tsa pentecoso It's a pena na o le nganga ai valele lok It's a pena lo wangang. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul. But my little heart is for you. You put it out to wangang, out to lotto, out to tino. O me ale tuole. So when you come to the Lord, you're not just spirit. You're spirit, soul, and body. And you need to prepare all the decks of your life. Are you all right? Ah, fire, le fire. On the melee, I really get concerned because many times most of our Pentecostal young people don't have good jobs because they're told to concentrate on spiritual matters so much that they become. Prepare. Hallelujah. I want our Pentecostal young people like Daniel and Meshach and Abednego and Jangatani. They were the standard in the world. But my God, I'm just praying. We feel the brokenness. I saw it in my ear. But my, if I say full of my God, I can't make it. Or Satan, Raka, me, Sako, ma, Peter, Nico, ma, Danielu. Elai, ma, Sesio, le, lo, langi, o, papelo, niya. Em, em, faiona, etu, tu, sa, malad. No one could hold a light to them. Why? Because everything was done and done well. Not just spiritual matters. We should have the best musicians. We should write the best songs. We should have the best singers. Why? We are here to glorify him who gave us the talent. Don't just remain a potential. Let the potential be realized. Hallelujah. May I tell you to you, Tassir Fajitoa. E tasi mal fa malama, but my kilo kanga. It does. The the difficulty is this. It wasn't a man who said, uh, "Jesus is the way." Jesus said, "I am the way. There's no other way." Pole alava lava mai. Ifa feka ka feka. Who cares? 
The person that said it was God himself. And he said, I am the only way. Doesn't matter who, where you live, whether you have a mission, or, I am the way, the truth, and the life. I am the door of the sheep. There is no other door. Hallelujah. <laughs> The only one window, look up. I was standing at uh, Odahuhu. My, my brother-in-law and I were, were there. He was doing some shopping and we were parked and I was sitting in the car and I saw, I was looking out and saw the TAB. And there was uh, an elder of uh, a Pentecostal church. <laughs> I, I won't tell you where he comes from because I'm online. And he was there with a little duffel bag in the back of his, and he was standing at the, the door of the TAB and he went like this. Look up. I have a person to in Langa or Tia or the elder or the Lot Pentecostal. I lay off for a It's a Pentecostal church in another city. So he was probably trying to find if there was any Aucklander that knew him and he was looking, looking, looking. He did not know that I was sitting in the car watching him. <laughs> and he jumped into the TAB door and I knew he was going in there to have a pecky. And I just, well, you know, I wanted to look up. When there are difficulties in your life, look up. Why? He sits, he sits on the flood. Hallelujah. He was a preacher of righteousness. So it's not only building, doing this and that, having a nice pulpit, he was preaching righteousness. Now, either he was a bad preacher, <laughs> Or the people were too wicked. In our own Aina Lava and a Faulina, and a Launga Yasoma, and I must have seen a Faulina. Oh, Loilesia, so Aluya, no Ile, Ile Maliu, for my Loma Noa, my Maliu, Arulva. A fellow called Ha, where did you get that from? He was a spiritual man. He was Holy Ghost, Methuselah, and Holy Ghost. By my la or the wing or ling or metzilla, a otiloa, saulolo. Or the tassila men of a titan at town on a teritonu yanoa, Fayakuka, what are you building? I'm building a boat. What's a boat? A thing that floats. Floats on what? Floats on water. For my look, you know how far away the sea is? Fafena Avelova. Then I make a wolf. Fafelanga, Abel Mengaf, Eopiope, Fafena, Abel, Sammy, the sea is so far away. Famelkala, Noah, 
my boat is not going to the sea. The sea is coming to the boat. <laughs> you know what that is? That's called faith. Or the wing ala ling o met sella, or the great 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 grandfather, or the Elena or no ala na fayerva. Na so song if I am going ala my stomach. Ah. Or the wing ala ling o toina, e o chilo sa de lolo. Ah, ma u mana tan o le toina. Ah. The Mangaree Lawn Cemetery. Ah, ma foi my ao noa, sabadi nung alva me kaka. What's he doing now? He thinks he's going into the ark because he thinks rain is coming. You realize, you realize, and you're preaching that to people, they don't even believe what you're saying. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And when the door was closed, the Maltana to Spoya, on a Tatala Lele Tua, fight to Tua or Langi. And break the seals of the deep. Esaulale le bai mai lalo, to esaule ki munga mai lunga. I fa mai tala noa. Sailing on the sea of His love, fa mai lo kala kuspaya ole lolo lale na amai le tua. Hallelujah. Na fano uma tangata. Noah sat on the flood. Hundred twenty days. Fast full was so fast full poor Kim. But Noah, when everything, he was sitting on the flood. How do you sit on a flood? 300, 50, 30. Hallelujah. So, hello to Sile. Papa, I'm not going to go to Maka. So, hello to Sile, Feso. Feso, I'm going to go to I'm going to read it in English. If you have a Bible in Psalm 1, you can read it in Psalm 1. I'm going to read from verse 14, and then I'm going to close. For this reason, I bow my knees to the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, from whom the whole family in heaven and earth is named, that he will grant you according to the riches of his glory to be strengthened with might through the Spirit in the inner man. That Christ may dwell in your hearts through faith, and that you, being rooted and grounded in love, may be able to comprehend with all the saints, including the ones at Gateway, what is the width, which is 50, the length, which is 300, the depth, which is three decks, the height, which is 30 cubits. You know what Tusie, Paulo le Tusia Efeso, he had Noah in mind. And Paul said, I wish the church will know and understand the meaning of 300, the meaning of 50, the meaning of 30, the three decks, the one door, the one window. But Paulo, that you may know the love of Christ that surpasses knowledge. Noah is not just a story in the Old Testament. 
ai tusi paulo i efeso ai ma fau fau paulo ileba what are you thinking about this morning or it's a talo la le apostolo for my i wish that everybody all the saints will understand what noah did because god wants you and i to sit on the flood if god's talking to you i want you to stand to your feet i tell no i tell you i tell you now the two lie men i tell all i want you to stand Hallelujah. I want to pray for us the same prayer that Paul prayed the Talomo Tato Tato Ainga Gateway. As we said just before, don't know when we'll be back, but we want to leave something in the church that you as a church will think not just individually but as a church that you will build according to the pattern 350 30 three decks one door one window that you as a church will do that and my prayer that god will grace your life and open the eyes of your understanding to do what he's called you to do heavenly father i stand in your presence and i stand with your people today this church gateway may be a gateway lord god to flood dwellers those who will build according to the pattern who will build their lives lord god their christianity that their families will survive whatever flood comes and i pray that gateway is a church would be built the same way it will be built and built well it'll be perfect it'll be anointed it will have tremendous potential that will be realized they will glorify jesus and they will continue to lift up the standard week after week after week that you will be glorified in the things that they do father i pray your blessing that makes rich and adds no sorrow be their portion today and always from rue tama it in i fa now a inga tai to tasi ele na tai lea ole a inga ole tua fa open a ina lo mato wa tua lo no ina la to fo si a lo mato wa tua le so i fu a fa le nganga lo mato tama e ma fa yai o na tie tie i lunga le lolo father bless them bless the church today ma yo na o se yo yo na i ya la to lo le man wias Sili sili ese male winga ese ese ole tua Father we bless you today in Jesus name Amen Amen give the Lord a hand